this is like the coda, I guess, on, I want to say the Katie Britt um, speech, but also maybe her career. Tommy Tuberville is the senior, uh, senior uh, senator, senator from Alabama. From Alabama. Oh, my wow. God. Tuberville first came out and said <clears throat> she did a great job. Uh, Katie Britt, she did a great job on the State of the Union. And uh, now, of course, um, he has changed his tune and um, he thinks that it didn't go well because he's been told that it's not didn't go well. And of course, he knows who to blame, not her. Attacking Biden over his border policies by citing something that happened in the Bush administration and in Mexico. Yeah, well, that obviously didn't go over too well. Uh, uh, I would think that the, uh, our leadership would have vetted that a little bit more because I would imagine they helped her with that. Mm -hmm. but that's Again, that's uh, a mistake made, but it was a good point of emphasis of what really goes on from the border. And I think that's what she was trying to get over more than anything. The vibes were right. It doesn't really matter what the details were. I liked her energy about it. He's really backing off of uh, how great she did the first time. Now it's like, well, you a leadership. I mean, uh, what are you guys five? This is like this is like a equivalent of like Tuberville like getting a tough question about a uh, like a five star recruit not playing particularly well. He's like, well, you know, it could be a conditioning thing. It's yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, but it's also just it's in keeping with what like Fox News is philosophy is too, where it doesn't necessarily need to be right; it just needs to feel right for as if the entire the panic about immigrants is vetted in any kind of way. Yeah. Hey, as we head towards the twenty twenty four election, both parties are going to attempt to control the media narrative so it's vital to know what you're reading and where it's coming from which is why our sponsor ground news is going to be absolutely crucial their website and app gathers related articles from around the world in one place with context about each source like whether they have a political bias how reliable they are who owns them etc go to ground.news slash majority to check them out one of my favorite features it's the blind spot feed, which shows you stories that are disproportionately covered by one side of the political spectrum. So when your neighbor tells you that one third of Americans think Biden's election was illegitimate, you're going to know he's talking about a poll taken back in December that was mostly covered by right leaning news sources. And then all of a sudden you guys have common ground to base your conversation in. You can actually engage with the facts, like, for instance, who conducted the poll? What was the sample size? If you sign up using my link, ground.news slash majority, you're going to get 40% off the Vantage plan, which includes unlimited access to the blind spot feed. It's a really good service with an important mission, so I hope you're going to check it out.